Come on. Come on, go potty. Come on. And it is 9.20 in the morning. As you see, as you guys just saw, I got up and did my little morning routine, I guess. Everything, it's something I do every single morning. Actually, today, Cody and I slept in a little bit. Normally, we wake up around like 7.30 because he wants to go outside. But he decided that he wanted to sleep in a little bit, um, which was great for me. I am so tired for some reason today. I need coffee in my life. So I think instead of going to Starbucks, I think I'm going to go get um, that one ingredient that I need from the store. And then make a coffee here because I have a lot of Nespresso pods that I need to use. But I wanted to say thank you Hungry Root for sponsoring this video. So yeah, we will get to Hungry Root in a second But let's go start the day with some nice homemade coffee. Okay, I actually got the ingredient finally <laughs> This is the only thing I needed. Now that's done. Let's go make some coffee at home. Oh my gosh, Cody Oh my gosh, Cody You just need to bite me? You just need a bite. Let's make this. Excuse the color of my hands compared to my face. We are going to make this coffee recipe that I learned from my good friend Jess. Jess, if you're watching, love you for showing me this recipe. All you're gonna need is A, an espresso, and B, these espresso pods. This is the double espresso pods. I'm actually, after this, I'm gonna um, try to use the Starbucks ones because I heard good things about those. So, I mean, you need this, um, Torani vanilla syrup, and just some good old heavy whipping cream. And you have a great coffee. Okay. My camera's gonna die, so I apologize if it cuts off, but I do a shot and a half of heavy whipping cream and two tablespoons of vanilla syrup, just in case I don't have time to explain. A shot half. I use a little Jaeger thing, <sighs> whatever. And two tablespoons, whoa, dogs. Two tablespoons of um, vanilla syrup, okay. Mix it all together and then add ice. We are gonna do a little taste test on my phone because my camera died. So I think next time I'm gonna add like cold foam on top. That's it, y'all. That's that's the coffee I love. Yum. Okay. Thanks for coming with me to my coffee creation now what i'm gonna do is i'm going to i'm gonna go upstairs and clean my room <sighs> get the day started gosh i just love you i just love you you're just my favorite you're just my favorite thank you for the kisses can i make my bed now i'm gonna go play with the doggies i'm gonna play 
I'm gonna play. <sighs> I'm gonna go play with the doggies. <laughs> Sunday mornings hiding under covers I don't mind staying in with you Play your favorite movie Laying right beside me I don't mind when it's just us two The corner coffee shop we like to go Late night walks with you to take me home With you I never feel alone These little songs make me glad to call you mine And you have got Something mine. I've been really into is manifesting. I feel like I've just been so in tune with the universe and just like seeing angel numbers and stuff like that, just feeling guided and protected. So I have a little manifestation journal that has literally like all of my manifestations so i like to do that every single day so that's what i'm going to do right now is do a little manifesting and i play like a little manifesting frequency on spotify i think i just looked at manifest manifestation frequencies i think that's the name of the artist and i do the 396 hertz manifest your dreams or the 639 hertz attract love and harmonize relationships i kind of just go in between those depending on what i am manifesting walk into the market strolling hand in hand exchanging letters when you're away don't need any effort when we are together We always have fun throughout the day I'll do anything to get your attention when you So that is done <laughs> Now that that's done, I am going to check I feel like my mouse battery is dying I'm going to check social media and YouTube and stuff and emails And get ahead on doing that I just spent some time on the computer and i responded to some emails for my wedding videography business if you guys don't know if you guys are new here i also film weddings on the side um i absolutely love it it is so much fun and if you are getting married or someone you know is getting married anytime soon you could book me to film your wedding using the website that i have linked down in the description box it's just mckenzieleskyfilms.com yeah and i'm relatively inexpensive so compared to everyone out there. So, I love it. I, yeah, it's like my favorite thing ever. So I just filmed, or not filmed, I just responded to some bookings. Now it is noon and I am hungry. So if you guys are unfamiliar with Hungry Root, Hungry Root is a tech-enabled grocery service delivered right to your door and catered right to your lifestyle and your tastes. So how Hungry Root works is you start by taking a short fun quiz before signing up. And this is where you can share how you like to eat, your dietary needs, and your goals. Whether that's eating more plants, whether that's um, saving money, saving time in the kitchen, whatever your goals are. Hungry Root sends personalized weekly deliveries filled with healthy groceries and 10 minute recipes. When your delivery arrives at your doorstep, you can mix and match ingredients with what you have in your fridge, or you could just stick to the simple 10 minute recipes. So whether you are looking to recommit healthy habits into the new year or try new foods, Hungry Root has you covered. They have simple, fast recipes for easy meal planning, personalized and tasty recommendations based on the customer's goals and needs, and it's great for product discovery because you have a wide variety of options for all diets. Hungry Root especially has helped me discover new and healthy foods and is helping me stick to my New Year's goals. So let's go downstairs and unbox and prep some lunch. I also wanted to mention that the first 100 people to use my code LUSKY40 will get 40% off of your grocery order at HungryRoot.com. So make sure you check the description box below for more information. We're gonna do a quick little haul. Pretzel buns. We have some um, coconut lime chicken bone broth, seaweed, some buffalo chicken sticks, mustache munchies, olives, tomato marinara, spinach artichoke, a little butter brownie, little snacks, 
wraps, little treats, which is good for my sweet tooth. Some cheese, more cheese, some whole eggs, more sweets, some bacon, yum, turkey breast, ooh, some chicken tendies, ooh, um, breakfast sausage and cheese, tamale, this is some beef burgers, and some grilled chicken breast. There's more fresh stuff. We have some broccoli, some spinach, some baby spinach. We have a little orange and some baby broccoli. And that's what's in my Hungry Root box. So I'm gonna put this all in the fridge. One thing, one good thing that I love about Hungry Root especially is now living at home. Cody wants food. Now living at home, Cody, no. Now living at home, it is hard to have my own groceries and stuff, especially when it comes to like the community fridge, basically. So it's really nice to have my own things and a little section of the fridge to myself. So I'm gonna put all this away. I already think I know what I want for lunch. So I think I'm going to make or try this plant-based chicken tenders. That just sounds so good to me for some reason. Eight grams of protein, no artificial flavors, made with pea protein. So I'm very excited to see how this tastes. Okay, I'm gonna make this in the air fryer because that's literally the best way to make anything these days. It says preheat to 400 degrees, cook tenders for nine to 10 minutes. So on this little paper, they have these little um, super easy recipes on the back of like the what's in the box. So I have an easy cleanup cheesy spinach artichoke chicken. I have a plant-based chicken parm tenders with bro broccoli, spinach artichoke turkey wrap, and juicy bacon cheeseburger on pretzel bun, which sounds really good and I might make for dinner tonight. And it takes 14 minutes to make. Like how easy is that? Wow. Wow. Look at Cody also. You just have to be on your my feet. You have to be on my feet, huh? Okay, does that not look so good? That seriously looks amazing. Okay. I'm a big ranch girly, so I need ranch. Oh, should I do Chick-fil-A sauce? I think I'm gonna do ranch and Chick-fil-A sauce. Big dressing slash dip girly. Amazing. I'm gonna sit and watch some Grey's Anatomy. I've been really, really, really into Grey's Anatomy recently. So I'm going to sit and watch this and eat my plant-based chicken tendies. Right now, one of my friends, her boyfriend, they checked Ken's driver's license. She's a donor. She's not a match for him, but she could save a dozen other lives. And from what I know about Kendra, I've heard that would be her decision. So the question is whether you stick by her one Oh my god. These are so good. Holy cow. Oh my god. I'm so shook. This is amazing, you guys. You guys really need to hop on Hungry Root. It's now 2.30. 2.40. <laughs> And I've been watching so many episodes of Grey's Anatomy because it keeps my mind preoccupied. And also just chilling with my doggy. Chilling with my doggy. You're a cute boy. I think I'm gonna get up now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna take him for a walk. I need to get outside a little bit. It's got cloudy and like kind of rainy, but I feel like I need to get outside, get some fresh air. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get into like warmer clothes because it's cold. I'm gonna go for a walk. I know you do. You wanna go play? You wanna go play? Big man in the sky, oh, black hole of desire. Who makes love go round, oh, what makes that retire? I don't like big crowds when talking gets too loud sometimes. Um, it is a little bit later. I'm still on the walk. The bad thing about this neighborhood is that it is such a busy neighborhood. Like, it's kind of like a connecting neighborhood to like major streets. So, there's 
all the time cars passing by, which is fine, whatever, but like for vlogging reasons, I'm like shy. Yeah, go body. But I am on my way back, venturing back home. I'm venturing back home, and then that is pretty much, see, I get looks from people. Um, that's pretty much it for my day. I'll probably make something for dinner with the rest of my hungry root. I'm not sure. Leave a comment down below which which of the recipes you think I should try. I'm gonna go home. Can I just relax for the rest of the night? I have zero plans. Feels good for a Monday. Yeah, I'll see you at home. Ooh, that smells good. Okay, you guys, that is it for my little morning routine slash day of my life. It's already four o'clock and I'm gonna get to editing this video and yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you're following me on all my social medias, Instagram, TikTok. I don't think there's any really other relevant social medias anymore, but yeah, I love you guys and thank you again, Hungry Root, for sponsoring this video. Everything will be linked down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Mm -hmm.